Good morning. Welcome to European Morning Call. And uh, stocks in Europe have opened a bit a bit weaker this morning. Uh, we saw a decent session for Europe uh, yesterday. Um, stocks rallying, uh, continuing on those gains from Tuesday. Um, but uh, or finished off the highs in the US actually was was weaker for the day. Uh, tech was up, Nasdaq finished up just a little bit, still below that uh, ten thousand level, and uh, the Dow is down 065 <coughs> percent. Excuse me. The S and P five hundred finishing at thirty one thirteen, um, weaker by uh, 036 uh, percent. Today we have the Bank of England. Um, it is uh, expected to expand QE uh, by at least 100 billion, but perhaps more uh, risks, risks on that front to, to the upside. The pound hovering around this 100 day moving average here, um, really um, coming sharply off that um, 200 day line there uh, on, uh, on, on Monday, um, and then pulling back uh, down here, but still. Very much sort of around this sort of channel, um, we've seen it move up through these, these this, this sort of recent range that it's been in. Um, if we look um, here, we can probably draw a nice Fibonacci line here, and sure enough, we're sitting on around that 38.2% retracement level. Um, looking perhaps at that 50% retracement level here, which was the low touched Friday uh, there. Um, uh, sorry, oh, that's Monday there. That's the Monday candle, excuse me, and that's the Tuesday candle. So the Monday candle, the low, hit the 50% retracement. The um, Tuesday candle came off the 200-day moving average, and now we're sitting around this 38% retracement. So uh, interesting sort of out, uh, setup here to see whether or not the, what the Bank of England does to push the pound maybe down that way to retest this level or potentially uh, throws up above the blue line and then which is uh, that that's uh, sort of old level of around this region we see this sort of 126 two sort of region is has been important uh, in the past it's not perfect but it's around that level um, we need to get above that and then look at that 200 day line again um, elsewhere um, gold just sitting around Gold stuck in its ranges, um, not doing anything really. Um, uh, crude oil uh, around that thirty-eight dollar level again, just in this tight, quite a tight consolidation pattern at the moment. Looking to see which way to go, which way to bend. And uh, uh, news on EU digital tax. Yes, pulling out of an EU digital tax. I mean, an impasse, impasse. Um, and uh, that's potentially got a knock-on effect for tech stocks in the US. So we'll keep an eye on that one. But we'll we need to see what happens there. Um, that's it for now. Uh, we will have more for you later. Remember, Bank of England due up at twelve, expecting that to uh, expecting that to um, mean more QE and what impact that might might mean for the pound. Thanks for watching.